hey guys and welcome back to another video welcome to sabrina budgets thank you so much for stopping by to checking out this video i really do appreciate it so today's video is going to be paycheck number three for the month of august which this is like somewhat of like my magic pay um so this is going to last me from august 30th to september 12th i can't believe we are already in september are you guys ready let me know in the comment section below are you guys ready for september i'm a little sad which i've been sad for the last past i think three years because i have no kids to take to school i know some people might be like girl that should be a good thing but when you don't have no more kids to take to school or just to take to school it's kind of like i know i'm getting older but that's not what you're here for so let's continue all right so i have my budget here and this is where i'm allocating 850 dollars so chase flex is getting 200 dollars, 200 dollars, and i already paid chase on yesterday right yes because I'm, I'm recording this the same day so yes i paid 200 dollars towards chase apple credit card i already paid which was the 73 dollars and 7373 is 146, I believe, but the payment is 145.66. MTA, I finally got my MTA. I don't have to worry about that. So that was $66. I transferred that over to bills. Now, laundry is going to get 20 because we can't forget laundry, which I need to be taking out more for laundry, which I should be taking out $40. But right now, I can't do that. So the other 20 is going to probably come out of a side hustle or something like that. Groceries, $200. I already spent $20. And I have already spent... How much did I spend already? I spent $20. And then... I think $45 I already spent from groceries. So I believe I have $155 left. Pet is going to get $40. But I already spent $20 because Brooklyn needed some food. So I have $20 left. My mom's birthday, $40. I transfer that over. My sister-in-law's birthday, I'm giving her 50. Transfer that over. Retirement got 25. I transfer that over. Emergency got 25. Sabrina Savings got 31. Christmas got 20. And the rest of that got transferred over to where it needed to be transferred over to. So the total for my expenses are $790. And then I have a buffer of $60, right? Yes, I have a buffer of $60. So let's see how that's gonna work. But look what's coming back. It's coming back. So I decided to break it up. As you can see here, I broke it up into what's going to be sinking funds, online sinking funds, and cash envelopes that are spent daily or throughout the week. So the reason why I'm doing this is because I'm noticing the other way that I did it, it was not working out for me. And I'm going to be honest with you, my budget has not been realistic. And that's going to be spoken in into the next the another video in September. Not the next video, but the probably the video after that. I have not been real with my own budget. And it's a shame to say it a little bit because it's like, girl, what you was doing? But I'll let you guys know exactly what I was doing. So guess what I got? I have cash. So what I'm doing is I have not labeled them yet. But this is how they are going to be. So I'm going to label them. And I think I have like 10 here. And then I'm going to have the smaller ones. And these are going to be in my wallet. So you guys would definitely be seeing that. I am going to stuff it off camera because I want to label everything and have time to do it. I just basically set everything up um, just a few minutes ago. So, and then I have $255 here, which... In cash, I have for my laundry, my groceries, which is $155, my pet, which is $20, and what else? Oh, and the $60 for buffer. So, look, I'm just trying to be as transparent as I can 
That other way wasn't working for me where I kept the money in the bank. It looked like I was spending more and not knowing. It's just weird. It was just weird. And I was just like, what are you doing? But that's near here or there. Like, it was just crazy. The budget was crazy. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Um, starting, well, I'm going to start it now, but starting my first paycheck of September, that's exactly what I'm going to be using is the envelopes again. And yes, I am putting everything in one envelope for, I mean, one binder for right now until I really decide what I'm going to, what's going to work for me. So the other thing didn't work, but then I'm going to keep trying until it works for me. So what else did I want to say? Let me show you guys. It's coming. It's coming along. So Brooklyn has um, $16 in his account. I have Christmas. Christmas is almost at $500, which I'm, I'm, I am excited. I didn't put anything for, um, for Sam or for Maya. And more or less, that's going to be coming out of Side Hustles, my birthday. So... If you guys remember the $50 that I gave myself from, I think my YouTube pay, I took out $20 for myself and then $30 went to my birthday fund. And then my savings is coming along. I'm hoping to, hoping to be finished this by my birthday, which is January 12th. So let's see if I can finish these by then. I'm hoping. Let's see. I'm gonna put all. I'm gonna try to pay off my debt and try to save. Um, retirement has now six hundred dollars, which I transferred over some. Um, I transferred over some funds. Car. I added some money. You guys are gonna see that. I didn't put nothing in sewing machine, which I want a sewing machine so bad. Um, I still have the hundred dollars at home. And I have um, $100 in emergency. So that is that for that. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll be seeing everyone in my next video. Bye.